after doing all. Um, I'm just going to take you through some what I discovered, um, or what I discovered is on the hotel. Uh, didn't realise it was actually on there. Um, so we got a, an old Tafira here. Um, it's had an ECU kit put on it, um, and it's got no communication with the ABS because it hasn't got ABS. So it just needs reprogramming can configuration to tell it it hasn't got ABS. Um, now we went to use the uh, Tech 2, uh, and it says seek TIS authorization uh, approval, uh, which is fine. I can just plug it on the computer and I get approval. Um, but we decided to use the Autel um, and just see if the Autel will do it. Now, interestingly, if we go to program can configuration uh, and let's just change this let's modify that to present on program because it hasn't got TIS approval still the auto comes up with the version is outdated and what it's actually going to do now is it's going to get TIS approval from the auto servers so now it's getting approval Turn that off. Back on again. So as you can see, it still needed TIS approval, but it sorted it itself from the servers. Um, there's something I didn't realize Autel did or had the potential to do. Uh, this is an old 2004 Safira. Um, that may be the same for newer uh, TIS approvals and certainly older TIS approvals. It's just something I discovered I thought I'd let you guys know. That'll be the same on the MK908, MS908, MS908P, uh, etc. Um, enjoy. Cheers.